Welcome to our little video on using our website, signing up for classes, and finding all the information you need about classes. Um, we have changed our website slightly recently. Um, we've got a new registration and class management system, and uh, here's just a little video on how to use it. Um, once you get the hang of it, it's going to be wonderfully easy for you to keep track of all the classes you're registered for, how many credits you've got left, your entire attendance and purchase history, everything will be right there. Um, and all you have to do is log into your account. So um, from our main website, about the classes is only descriptions. We don't have any pricing or any calendars there. All that happens on our registration website, which is sign up for classes. Click there, and there's a registration system. Um, there's a, a written description on how to use it, but this video should get you quickly through that. Um, there's two ways to sign up for classes. You can do go, bleh, excuse me. You can do it through the calendar, or through sign up now. Under sign up now, you'll just see the memberships. You won't see the class schedule. So a membership, for instance, is a certain number of classes for a certain price. So for instance, uh, burlesque, belly dance, and hoop classes are all the same. Um, you get six classes for $70. So that's a membership. Um, I'll just click in there to show you that page and you see all the different memberships under the categories. So we've got special offers, um, pole dance and fitness memberships, um, specialty dance and fitness, which is the belly dance, burlesque, and hoop, um, exclusive fitness classes, that's your yoga classes, the cardio classes, and then any other types of classes we have. Lifestyle classes are non-dance uh, classes and we hope to be adding to that program in the future. We've also got open studio practice times for current students who just need to come in and get some studio time. You know, they don't have a pole at home or they're working on a number and need the space in the big mirror. So you can go ahead and purchase the memberships directly from this page. If you already have been coming to classes and you know what day your classes are on, you know, that's just a quick way to get into uh, getting your new set of credits. The calendar is where you'll see our whole class listing. You can get into pricing information, everything you need to know about the class. We default by showing you a list of classes. It just seemed to look like the most organized way to put all of our classes on one page. So you'll see these are just the classes for this week. You'll see each day and all the classes in order. You can sort this because this is a lot of information on one page. We do a lot of classes in a week and we plan on adding more. So you'll want to use the drop down boxes to sort. So if you're just interested in only seeing our pole dance classes, you can look at the calendar and view only those. Burlesque, hoop, you know, etc. View whatever classes you want. Drop in classes, most of our classes have a drop in option, and that means that you don't need a membership. Um, you don't have to have a package of six class credits. You can just do a single class drop in. And I'll show you how to sign up for a drop in. Uh, but these are all the classes that are eligible for that. Just come on in for one single class. You can view classes by staff. So if you want to see all the classes Corey teaches, there they are. And you can also view le by location. Now, of course, our locations aren't exactly separate locations. They're both in the same zip code. We just have two different rooms, basically, in two buildings um, in the Midtown area of Cleveland to hold our classes. But you will always know which class or which studio your class is at, main studio classes through the week and auxiliary studio classes through the week. The main studio is the 1242 East 49th Street location on the third floor and the auxiliary studio is the 3635 Perkins, the one we've been at for a little while 
up on the fifth floor. Both are in 44114 zip code. There's also other ways you can view this calendar. Of course you can use the back and the next buttons to go view the next weeks. So this is the list view. I'm over here on the top right corner. You can also view the calendar more like a traditional calendar and view the week. It is very useful because you'll see how all these are on top of each other just because they're the classes at different studios so they overlap. It's very useful to sort this view especially for the evenings. You can also view our calendar by the month. Looks like I do need to cancel all the classes on July 4th. <laughs> um, but there's a more traditional calendar view for you as well. So whatever is easier, you've got that flexibility. So I'm going to go back to the list view. Um, let's say you want to see what the cost is for our beginner hoop class and you're interested in attending on July 2nd, even if you're not interested in attending July 2nd, you can still just click on the class and see what the pricing information is. I'm going to click on that. Pop-up box comes up, so there you get your drop-in price of 15 and here are the eligible memberships for this class. This class is good on our summer pass, which is a special right now. Six classes. See if you wanted to purchase the summer pass, you can just select that radio button and go ahead and register for the class. You can get hoop credits off of all belly dance burlesque and hoop membership. And let's say you already have taken a $15 drop in. You can get five more classes after taking that drop in and that drop-in would be applied. So if six classes is $70, then after a drop-in, five classes is 55 So you can register for the class from there. If you already have a login for this website, you can just log in. Or if you don't, go to register, and that'll give you a chance to get an account set up. All right, so that is how to find out about our class schedule, pricing, different membership options. I hope this has helped. Uh, check out the next video on actually using your membership account. Um, I'll be using a test account and actually log in and manage some class registrations.